Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I would like to share my experience about collagen. This thing over here, first of all, we need to know what it is. It's a supplement, basically. It's supposed to give you better skin or take care of your skin health, joint health, bone health, and muscle mass recovery because it is a protein source. So what this does contain are amino acids you don't really normally find in protein powders. That's why I was interested in actually, you know, taking this. Um, I'm not a believer of collagen, taking collagen. Like in my mind, I'm thinking like if you eat collagen, you produce collagen. That doesn't make any sense because that's like saying if I ate chicken, then I would become a chicken. So I, I always had the mentality that collagen supplements do not work. But because I scrolled through all the YouTube sections and YouTube videos, people have their experiences taking it one year, you know, things like that. And they show improvements over collagen. So I decided I might as well do it with myself, you know, take an experiment. I've been taking this collagen about a scoop every day for the past six months or so. Uh, this one is type one and type three grass fed paste, pasture raised collagen peptide. So uh, not sponsored by the way. So yeah, I've been taking this for six months, about one scoop. I mean, it says normally to take two, but my protein consumption is pretty good. So a lot of the YouTube videos that I have looked over when it comes to collagen or even from my friend's personal experience is that they do not consume the recommended protein amount, like just regular protein amount per day. So I just typed in collagen on YouTube and these are some of the videos I've watched from this guy over here, 1 million views. Uh, and then from a doctor over here, uh, all the ones that have the red highlighted, I have watched. Uh, 24 minutes I watched these uh, collagen is so effective collagen when taking mistakes and one year after collagen I watched all sorts of these videos and yeah that's where I'm basing off my little study about this collagen thing and I am doing that same experience on myself with the collagen supplements as for me I consume a lot of protein per day and so I will know the difference between whether having collagen in my diet or and uh, supplement it with my protein intake. What I found out in my conclusion is that I did notice some differences, but those differences were not my skin. My skin just remained the same, but my bones, uh, not necessarily it got stronger, my joints or anything like that. I noticed that I started cracking more often like my joints started cracking. It has to do with like every time I moved, it kind of felt like I needed to crack my bones and then I even hear some of the crack. Of course, it did not hurt or anything. Uh, based on science, if you are consuming more protein, you're going to have a lot of nitrogen gas that builds up and then those will go into your bones and then they will give you that cracking feeling. So let's actually get into the specifics. So the protein or the amino acids that collagen peptides do contain is glycine, proline and hydroxyproline. These are the amino acids that are in here. So in order to be getting these kinds of amino acids in your diet, you'll be eating or drinking bone broth, uh, skin on the poultry, fish, uh, pork skin, beef, gelatin, bone in cuts, egg whites, uh, citrus fruits, berries. So things like that will have these types of amino acids in it to basically help the production of collagen in your body. So I normally consume about 130 grams of protein per day. I added 10 extra grams of collagen uh, protein in my diet for the six months every single day. Notice zero differences except for the bone cracking. I say it's a scam. I will not be taking any more of the collagens. I bought four tubs of these just to, you know, continue it on for a little bit longer to like maybe more than a year and see if there are any changes but at this point in time i'm just throwing it into my protein and uh yeah i don't feel the differences from it and i think it's a waste of money at least that is from my experience again remember that my protein consumption is already on its maximum and adding the, this collagen which is a different type of amino acids that is made up of in this thing i guess you don't really need to consume these types of amino acids your body is able to make those types of amino acids in the body with your regular protein uh, diet because i just drink my whey protein and eat regular proteins eggs chicken you know 
and take some fish oil and stuff like that and yeah collagen peptides do not work i don't care all these youtube videos claiming that they helped them but i'm pretty sure it helped them because they were just getting a little bit more protein into that diet that's that's about it i don't think it's because collagen itself is was helping them basically improve their skin because it didn't improve my skin what a ripoff okay guys so that's all i have for today uh leave a comment if you ever try collagen and if it ever works for you it didn't work for me if it did work for you just make sure like were you consuming a lot of protein in the first place if you weren't maybe you should try just regular protein because collagen supplements can be quite expensive compared to just your regular way so yeah try your regular protein and see if you know which one is you know if you don't notice a difference or anything like that and just let me know in the comments below other than that i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.